The, the general attitude of uh, Western European and North American elites was summed up in a tweet I saw from Anders Aslund, who's a, a, an academic who writes lots of interesting books on this subject, and he tweeted out, if Hungary really votes overwhelmingly against democracy uh, and for corruption, I cannot see why it should be accepted in the EU. Kick it out. So the voters of Hungary, John, are guilty of uh, voting overwhelmingly against democracy. Uh, they demonstrate their hostility to democracy by voting in uh, massive numbers. Uh, I don't think Anders Asland is, has, I think he tweeted in haste there, but it basically sums up how Brussels and Washington think of the guy. And a lot of other people. I mean, a man called Yasha Monk, who's a distinguished professor of political science at uh, John Hopkins University and also an intellectual valet to Tony Blair in one of his many democracy mm. support organizations. He said exactly mm. the same thing. And it makes you wonder what they actually think the purpose of democracy is. If it isn't to allow the voters to vote for someone who agrees with them. And there's no doubt that the voters generally agree with uh, uh, with the two thirds anyway, generally agree with with Viktor Orban. Um, the other, mm. the, the reason he's not popular in Brussels or with uh, and as Anders Asland is two two things. The first is that he is not an enthusiast for either global governments or Euro governments. He thinks most of the decisions uh, in politics should be taken uh, by the voters and by the elected representatives in national parliaments. And they don't agree with that. They, essentially, they believe in more Europe, which is grabbing more powerful national parliaments and bringing it to Brussels. And the other reason is he's a social conservative. That is to say, he likes things to, not exactly the way they were, um, uh, but he certainly um, is thinks that the old attitudes, uh, the religious traditions, the moral traditions, the cultural mores of the country should be respected, respected by the courts, respected by international organizations. And, um, and a lot of the voters think exactly that. They don't want to live in a different country in the way that so many people in Western Europe have suddenly wake up to find themselves doing. And, and, um, mm. and therefore, they, they, they rallied to him. Uh, but there are, there are other very practical reasons too, Mark. 